Hey guys, Gator Mom here. I hope you're having an awesome day. Today I have the Lily Jade Anna packed up two different ways. All right, so earlier this week I shared a full thorough review on this bag and I showed you it completely empty and I went through all of the different pockets and all of the different ways that you can carry this bag. So definitely check that out for a more thorough review on this bag. But I wanna go rather quickly because I decided to show you two different ways that you could pack up this bag because it is so versatile and there's so many different ways that you can use this bag. I decided to pack it up as an airplane carry-on or a travel bag just for myself. That's how I have it packed up right now. And then I'm gonna go into showing you how I would have it packed up as a Disney or theme park bag for myself and my kids because I think that this bag would be awesome, awesome, awesome for that type of a day. So right now, like I said, I have it packed up just for myself for a travel bag or like an airplane carry-on. Um, I have here on the front the optional messenger strap. I would probably just go ahead and leave it on the bag um, for myself if I was carrying it for like a carry-on just because I do like to throw it over my shoulder sometimes. For the purposes of this packing video though, I am going to go ahead and take it off just so it's not like flopping around for the bag. On the back here of the bag, I do have the backpack straps just um, on the bag here. I don't have them like off at on or off at all. I don't have them tucked in or anything like that because if I'm traveling, I would probably carry it 90% of the time on my back. So I would just have them kind of hanging out like that. On the side for the um, like bottle pockets, if you will, of the bag, I have a 17 ounce swell bottle. You can definitely fit the largest swell bottle over here. I actually pulled it down. I don't know what how many ounces this one is. I always forget, but I did pull it down just so I could show you for size reference. I mean, it definitely fits like with no problem. So if you wanted to carry a big one, usually if I travel with a like bottle of some sort, it's going to be like the medium size. I don't need a large one. So that's what I have there in that size. Then over here on the other side of the backpack, I do have a sunglass case. This is a GGB B Shady. And in here I have sunglasses and my eyeglasses. Then moving on to the front of the bag, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I have in these pockets and then move around to the other side of the bag. So you have two different pockets in the front of this Lily Jade Anna. You have a small pocket or a smaller one, I should say. Both of these pockets are really, really good sizes, so I wouldn't say either of them are small, but the smaller of the two is down here, and then you have another one that's kind of hidden. You almost don't even know it's there looking at it from the front, but it goes the entire length down here of the bag. But right here in the front, I have things that I would grab for quickly, like my cell phone, I also have in here a Posh Healer stick, which I use as a chapstick. And then I have a hand sanitizer and a hand cream. Then in the pocket that is located directly behind that one, I just have a um, book that I would be reading on the airplane. This is one that I'm currently reading right now. And then right next to that, I just have one of the Lily J packing cases. This is the smallest case of the pack of three. If you guys have not checked out these packing cases, you totally need to. I love, love, love these. They actually just released two new colors in them. So there's tons of different colors that you can choose from. But what I have in here is just a couple of snacks, like a granola bar. I have some cashews. I have tea. I have a little chocolate. I have a little emergency pack that I always take like on airplanes. So they're just like nice and convenient inside that small little pouch there. I would put things like in this front pocket that I would grab for the most if I would be on an airplane. So that's what I have there in that front pocket. Then of course you have your Lily J tassel down here kind of hanging out on the front of the bag. But these pockets, like I said in my kind of review, are so big, you can fit so much. You could put a wallet up here, your passport, everything that you would need right there on the front of the bag. So getting on into the main part of the bag, kind of the first bag of the two that are built into this bag, I have inside here um, the medium size packing case. And this is all of like my travel type necessities, if you will. I'm not gonna pull everything out of here, but I have things like a hairbrush and like an essential oil roller. I have hair ties, medicine. I have some posh sticks. I have a rose water spray 
toothbrush, toothpaste. I have like a tampon back there and some band-aids, all of that kind of stuff. All like my, my little things, if you will, inside this medium case. Um, it fits perfectly. It's really slim lying down in here. What I would probably throw here on top, like right before I went, would be my scarf or like my blanket type scarf that I would travel with. I always travel with one of the two, even if it's during the summer, just because airplanes are cold and they're nasty and whatever. So that would go right here on top and you would have plenty of room for that. Right here next to it, I have a small clutch that I always tend to travel with. It's like my favorite small crossbody. And what I decided to do here is use this as my wallet because inside I have a small little place to put like my cards and everything right here. And it would be really easy to just get my ID and everything out on the airplane. So that's what I have inside this. So this acts as like my clutch and also my wallet. So whenever I would get to wherever I was going, I can leave this in the hotel or at my sister's house or wherever I am traveling to and then just get this out and I'm like right ready to go. So. I have that in there and I have this in here and I still have plenty of room to put like a scarf or whatever else it is that I need. Right here in the bag, you have two little pockets. I just have a bunch of cash here and some gum inside this pocket. In this pocket here, I just have a pack of wet ones and I don't have anything back here in this zipper pocket. It is a very deep zipper pocket, but I actually don't have anything packed back there in that pocket at the moment. Love the way this organizes. I just think it's awesome for a carry-on bag. And carrying it on with kids would be a dream. <laughs> like so many ways you can organize it. So moving on to the back part of this bag, I'm actually going to, I think I will leave it like this to show you all, but these two zippers actually unzip all the way down on the side of the bag as opposed to the other one that only goes halfway down in the bag and it opens up completely flat so you can really see everything that's inside your bag now if you're traveling you don't necessarily need to open it up that wide you can just get out whatever you need into the bag but right here on this front flap you do have a padded spot for your laptop which is exactly what i have in there it's a 13 inch MacBook and that just slides right in there. Then right behind here, I have my planner. I also have another little calendar and then I have a big spiral notebook. All that fits perfectly. Then right behind there, I have so much organization. I love it. It looks just so nice, neat, organized. It's perfect. I just love how everything just has a spot and it's just great. I just have a medium set piece right here. This is a um, pouch made by Jujubee and inside here, I just have all of like my charging cords for my laptop and my phone and my watch and everything right here inside. And then right next to it here, I actually have two little um, stickers or sticker books for my planner and they're like the perfect size to go inside here. And then I just have all my pens neatly hanging out right here. So I can actually just leave this open. If I'm like at a Starbucks working or something, I can have all my stuff like, so it's like a little portable office to go. Like it's, it's so awesome. I love, love, love it. It's just, it's amazing. And I have all these pens, obviously like I could put washi down there. I can put like a stapler down there. I mean, you can put whatever it is that you need um, to kind of work remotely, if you will. So I have all of that kind of tucked down in there. So that is how I would have it if I was traveling. Um, I do kind of fly pretty frequently. Like I go up to Maine a lot to visit my sister. Or I travel for, you know, whatever it is that I need to. So that is exactly how I would use this bag and I cannot wait to use it the next time I travel. So that's how I have it um, packed up for that. I'm gonna go ahead and pack it up um, for a day out for a long day for Disney and show you guys exactly how it would work for that. This is how I have the Anna all packed up for a day at Disney and I'm absolutely obsessed with the way that this bag has packed for a day at the park. I, I absolutely love it. I can't say enough about it. Everything fits so well in here and it's super organized. I have it packed for a full, full day out, like sun up to sundown, all five of us like like in it for the whole day. So that's kind of how I have it all organized. And I'm just gonna show you everything that's inside of it. So attached here to the leather grab handle that's here at the top, I have all of our magic bands. 
I usually will keep a park bag like already packed, ready to go all the time in our like laundry slash mudroom. That way it's just ready to go. We're annual pass holders, so we tend to go like randomly sometimes, but usually our magic bands just hang out like on the side of the bag and then we put them on like on our way to the park. So those are attached there at the top. On the back of the bag, I'm not gonna show you that because there's nothing, it's just the straps. Um, it's I would carry this 100% backpack mode. I wouldn't even have the shoulder strap attached to it because I would carry a backpack the whole time. On this side pocket over here, I just have a hand sanitizer attached to the D-ring over here on the side. Then I have all of like hand stuff basically in this side pocket over here. I have two packages of wet ones. I also just have my sunglasses like tucked down here. These are like cheapy sunglasses anyway, so I wouldn't be too worried if something happened to them. Then I also have in here an Honest Company hand sanitizer spray. Sometimes I like to like use this on the kids and sometimes I use the spray. I mean, you can never have too much like hand sanitizer stuff when you're at the parks anyways. Then over here in this side pocket, I just have one of the big swell bottles. Um, we can share this as a family of five when we go to the parks. Um, we'll sometimes buy water bottles while we're there or I'll sometimes take one of these. It's just hit or miss depending if we're going for a full day or if we're going for like a shorter time. So that's what I have inside um, those two side pockets. Then in the front pockets, I actually don't have anything inside this pocket here. I like to keep one pocket always just kind of empty for if we like buy candy at the park, if we buy something in one of the gift shops, if the kids get park maps and they want me to like shove them in my bag. So I don't have anything inside this pocket here, but there's definitely room for something in there if I need it. Inside this front pocket down here, I actually just have a Jujube Be Charged as my wallet. And then I also have a Posh Healer Stick as Chapstick. And then I have a bunch of gum just kind of shoved down in that pocket, um, you know, if I need some while I'm at the park. So that's all that's in that um, down there. Then I'm actually gonna move on to the back of the bag and show you that first, because that's kind of like um, pretty awesome, the way that that's all packed up. That's um, the part of the bag, if you remember from where I showed you before, that has the laptop sleeve in the front and it unzips the whole way down the bag. Now, if you're using it like at a park, just remember you don't have to unzip it the whole way to get what you need out of it. I just unzipped it halfway down and inside the flap here in the front where you would typically hold like a laptop or you know books or whatever you need, I have in there the large Lily Jade packing case and I have all of our autograph books. It works so good. I was like blown away at how perfectly they packed in there. I have three autograph books and pens attached to them. And then I just have a little GGBB tagged. And what I have in there is all of our actual Disney passes because sometimes you need the actual passes for discounts at restaurants or shops or if one of the magic bands decides it doesn't wanna work or something like that. So I always carry them just in case, but everything fits so good inside this large packing case. I absolutely love the way that it fits and it's so streamlined and it fits so good in that back sleeve there. Like I can't get enough of it. It's like perfect. I can just pull this out and carry it by the wristlet and still have this on my back and we can go from like character to character. And I mean, I, I can't like say enough. I like absolutely love it, love it, love it. So then what I have just sitting right in front of it there are my daughter and I's mini ears. The, this is just like one pair of like a ton that we have just kind of hanging out in there. And then down here, if I unzip it, a little bit more to show you guys the two elastic pockets. I have our monkey mat if we want to sit on that, um, if we're like waiting for a parade or um, just something if we want to sit down and eat or whatever. And then in this pocket here, I have four just um, rain ponchos. This is just for obviously if it rains at the park and we want to put them on. My husband never puts one on. Like I've bought him one like time and time again and he just won't wear one. He would just rather get soaking wet. So I only have four in there because he never wears one. <laughs> so I have one for me and each of the kids. If we're in like a really, really bad downpour, like usually like walking to our car, like, I mean, something like that. Um, if we need them, it just has to be really heavily raining for us to actually put one on. But there's been times that I haven't had a poncho that I've really wished I've had one. So I tend to always carry them now. So that's what I have back here in this pocket. Love the way it organized. 
Now moving on to the front, which is, I mean, even just as awesome as the back. <laughs> I'll show you kind of what I have inside the front of the bag. I have it organized with two Jujube B dappers and look how beautiful that looks. I mean, it's like so awesome. It's like you could just grab whichever one you need if you're sitting and waiting for like a parade, for a show. Like, I just, I love it. I can't say enough about it. So inside this bee dapper, I have a ton of snacks. Cause remember we're going like all day and we tend to just snack a lot and try not to eat like maybe one meal while we're there, like a, a lot of food. But in here is like tons and tons of snacks for all five of us. I'm not gonna empty the whole thing out cause it'll take forever, but it's tons of granola bars. I have an entire pack of graham crackers down there. I have nuts and I have yogurt raisins. Um, I have like some lollipops and treats up here in this little um, zipper pocket here in the front. This bee dapper is like awesome for snacks. It's just, it's so good. And I love the way it fits like right there in the front. I can just grab it out and it's like good to go. Then over here in this other bee dapper, I have a ton of activities for the kids. So if we're again, waiting for a parade or we have downtime or whatever, cause we have tons of that like at Disney for like wait times, I can get out like a bunch of twistable crayons and they can color with like a play pack or one of these little um, coloring books. I have a ton of um, Paw Patrols in here. There's like six or some odd number in here. I have cars down in here. I mean, you name it. There's also a little dice game. That left center right game is in there. Up here in this front, I have wiki sticks. You guys know that my kids like are obsessed with wiki sticks. so. This is just another awesome way to organize the front of that. And you have both of your bee dappers. You can grab whichever one you need. The kids can put them back in there super easy. It's just awesome. Then just laying down there at the very bottom underneath those bee dappers, I have a change of clothes for my four-year-old. He is like fully potty trained. He's almost five, but if we're all day long at Disney and he gets his clothes wet, like at one of those like water things or if God forbid he has an accident, I don't wanna be there without a change of clothes. So I have a full change of clothes and socks and everything just laying down there at the bottom of the bed. Then last but not least, in these pockets behind here, I did actually use them this time. Um, I have just some cash right here in this pocket. I have a little baggie of like some plastic bags in here. These are those absorbent bags. So if somebody has like an accident or if somebody's sick or you know something of that nature, these are like plastic grocery bags, but they have an absorbent bottom. So they'll hold liquid. Um, so I have those down in there. Then I also have in this zipper pocket back here, all of like small things. I have a brush for my daughter with a little hair tie in there. I have a little thing of Dramamine and Excedrin and Advil. It's like all purpose medicine in there for the whole family. I also just have some itch cream for bug bites, Benadryl. My kids always get bug bites and I never have that on me. So I always tend to carry it. Then I just have a little Johnson and Johnson Medi kit that I've made by myself. I took like what came in here and then I've added all my own stuff, like some um, like allergy, like Claritin for kids and band-aids and Neosporin, wet wipes, like just a little on the go med kit. And if it's perfect down there in that little zipper pocket. So again, I have everything that I need. I think I actually like this packed up for Disney almost better than a carry on. And this nylon material is like perfection for Disney, like super lightweight, wipeable. I don't have to worry about it getting wet, like awesome. I love it. So I hope you guys um, enjoyed this bag packed up both of these ways. Sorry this video is so long. I just wanted to share it packed up both ways. Um, so if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them um, below and I will talk to you soon. Have an awesome day.